guys welcome back to my channel I'm doing a cook with me in my air fryer I wanted to share with you how I cooked chicken shawarma raw chicken thighs covered in shawarma seasoning in the air fryer it seems like it would be complicated but it's really not that complicated and the best thing is you don't have to use oil because you don't it's in an air fryer so it doesn't really require a whole lot of oil and chicken thighs have a lot of fat in them anyway so now you see me adding the package of the chicken shawarma thighs from Trader Joe's into my air fryer so I'm just putting them I put the whole package in one as a single layer uh, evenly distributed as usual and then I pop it into the air fryer and then I turn it on as soon as after I plug it in and then I set the temperature for I think it's like 360 yeah 360 degrees Fahrenheit I have it set for uh, a reminder to turn it over halfway through and we're gonna cook it in the air fryer for about 15 to 16 minutes well, I'll pick 16 minutes All right and I'll let it preheat and all that stuff while it's in there. That's, I'm okay with that. So I found the recipe or the instructions I should say from this um, site called Lemon Pepper Air Fried Chicken. Oh no, it's called My Forking Life. <laughs> anyway, it shows you a, a recipe for the lemon pepper air fryer chicken. You can make that recipe too. But I just wanted to look for a time and a temperature. That's the main thing. And so I'm using this particular site for the information. So it says boneless chicken thighs, 360 degree Fahrenheit for 15 to 17 minutes. And then also you have one for bone chicken thighs, bone in chicken thighs, 360 for, I'm too late, I don't know how many minutes. Anyway, halfway through, I um, turned it over, or flipped the chicken thighs over. Look, they look pretty, pretty good and let them finish cooking in the air fryer. There they are, coming out of the air fryer, perfectly cooked. Look at that, beautiful, with no oil added. And look at all that grease coming out. All the grease, the juice from the chicken. Oh, mmm, beautiful, and so good. And it's really tasty, and it still has that little crispness on it. So I hope you'll enjoy this video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.